Hello everybody, welcome to the video. I'm Vice Troy and today I decided we're gonna take another look at Supermarket Simulator. So it's been about three months since you last played this. It's had a few updates in the meantime, so let's start a new game and give it a go, shall we? So field of view, nothing to change in the settings. New game. Yes. I'll just delete the old game, start again. Welcome to Supermarket Simulator. We'll start with a small store and grow to an awesome supermarket. Start by purchasing goods to sell and place them onto shelves. Don't forget to set the prices with profit to avoid bankruptcy. Have fun. So, yeah, even though I only played this game about three months ago, I still can't remember what to do. <laughs> That's not good, right? Um, how much money do we have? We have $50. Okay. It's 8 a.m. Um, let's buy some cereal and some sliced bread and that's already all our money so click purchase da da and then i think it just uh burns up right so the latest update brings some customization uh custom blah, 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 some customization options to the game can't i can't talk today um we'll try to have a look at if we get that far i'm guessing you can sort of like change the the sign above your shop maybe change the flooring change the wall color Maybe even change the color of the shelves, possibly. Maybe even the checkouts. Oh, box has arrived. Da 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 da. And then open and place onto the shelf. Nice. Throw empty box into the trash can outside. Oop. And here's our chalky pick. Well, the graphics are pretty good, to be fair, don't they? Some cereal boxes. Some high definition cereal boxes, folks. Running, ooh, shift to run, that's good. Set the price of the product. Okay, so average cost is 99 cents, market price 396. So does that mean we just go for 396? And then with this one, 299, we bought it fast, so we set it for 598. Let me know in the comments so they're not 100 sure there but am i pricing things too low or th was the market price like sort of the what you should aim for price wise check the sign we're now open Doo -doo -doo -doo. Ooh, we have a first customer are you going to buy cereal or bread Oop. 5.98 please and cash um ah okay giving $44 change down. Uh, proof. I to think for a sec. It's like telling me right on the screen what to do. Maybe you should pay attention to that. You're going to go for some cereals sir, and some bread because why not? So level one. Okay, so boop, boop. Your card. Click on the card reader and your 994, which you can just type in on your keyboard. So handy to do. You just want bread, no problem, paying on card. Okay, 396, thank you very much. So numpad on your keyboard, if you have one, works perfectly well with the card machine. It's so much easier, six cents. There we go. And confirm with the space bar. Close checkout. One checkout. Oh, you can actually close it. Why would you want to do that? I suppose if you have more than one checkout, it'd be handy. But we don't, so we're not. Um, we now have $30. We buy some more products. Let's buy some flour and some pasta and some powdered sugar. Yes, please. We have two cents remaining in our account. <laughs> it's not a lot, really, is it? Uh, good. Ooh, we pay by card, no problem. $9.94. Oops. Thank you very much for your custom. Um, has escaped to get off the checkout. Always good. Oh, a new products have arrived. Uh, wait just a second. Da 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 da. Boop. Set a price on this. We'll get the rest of the boxes in a sec. So market price four eighty three. Let's go four eighty five. Some cereal fuser, and you're paying by card five ninety eight. Thank you very much. I do find it easy when they pay by card. No change. Unless they don't want change. Then that's easy too. Bucks. It's currently 11.26 a.m. So time is going. Not too quickly, which is good. 
like before you know it the day's gonna be over so we do have some a decent amount of trading time left so market price 312 let's go for 315 216 profit per sale and then top shelf here i do feel like the product graphics have improved but it might just be imagining that um 371 let's go 380 push the boat out a little bit here uh no problem thank you you got 15 cents change there we go so objective our first objective is to perform 25 checkouts sorry if i speak a little bit fast in this video folks i think it's like a welsh thing we, we do tend to talk quite quickly not always good because sometimes we trip over our words too but that might just be me Okay, so 9 out of 25. Boop, boop. Thank you. 776. Thank you very much. So yeah, if you didn't know, I know I've said it already, use your numpad with a card reader. Much easier than clicking on the buttons. Okay, we're waiting for our next customer. Red supplies are okay. What else can we order? Um, ooh, furniture. Paint. Upgrade your store to unlock customization. Uh, ah, right, okay. Makes sense, though. Um, next customer, cereal, no problem. $5.98 for you, sir. And $8, oh, no, $80. That would be way overcharging. I think the game would stop you if you tried to do that, but who knows? So $3.96. Let's charge $4 for bread. I mean, that's, that seems really expensive, doesn't it? But... And cereal, $5.98. Let's go $6. Yeah. Okay, so 3.05 p.m. Close our sec. Management. Product license. Okay, so we can purchase a new product license when the store gets to level 3. And that means we can sell these new products then. That's handy to know. Oh, hello. Thank you for waiting. I like your t-shirt. Um, $1 change. There we go. Just bread, no problemo, and one dollar change for you. So this, I'm guessing, is a storeroom which we don't currently have access to. Light switch. Ah, okay. Leave that off though because it's daytime and we don't need it yet. And if we can save electricity, then I'm all for it. Because bills and rent are due at some point in the not too distant future, I dare say. But we can hire cashiers. That's good to know forgot you could do that but the store has to be level 10 to be able to do that and we have to have already done 200 checkouts by ourselves and daily wage 80 so we're not really in a position to pay those kind of wages at the moment because we're not really um selling that many products like we haven't got a big enough store yet to stock a lot of products and i feel like we need to be moving a lot of products out to be able to afford any kind of regular wage Storage. Storage is locked. Eight hundred dollars to purchase, and then customization. Okay. Thank you. Uh, no change. Happy days. Nine more checkouts to complete the objective. And now it's getting dark. Let there be light. We have seventy-four dollars now. Though we're not doing too bad. Cash. Ten dollars thirty. Ten. 30. Thank you. We buy more products. Um, bank. Oh, we can take out loans. We don't want to don't do that yet. There's probably a time and a place for loans, but are we quite there yet? Maybe not. Let's buy some more bread. It'll still leaves us with a decent amount of money afterwards as well. Two boxes of cereal for you. We're having a party, are we? <laughs> I mean, who has a party with boxes of cereal? But then again, it might be a thing. How long does it take for deliveries to turn up then? Ooh, it's dark. Well, graphics-wise, it doesn't actually look that bad, does it, to be fair? Hello? Cereal? No problem. I mean, I say you're only buying cereal. We, we don't really have a lot of choice, do we? It's either cereal or pasta or, you know, some bread, some sugar. It's a bit boring quick, though, isn't it? Um, completely forgot for the moment then. He handed me his card. Oh, a couple of purchases. Nice. Eight. You paid with a hundred dollar bill. Wow. 50, 60, 70, 80, and two, three, four, and 30. Oh, oops. Sorry. I'm going to short change you a dollar then. 
Has our delivery turned up? <gasps> it has. More bread for the shelf. And I guess because the display is full, we just like drop that in the corner. Because we don't really have a warehouse thing yet, do we? But I guess it will just go in the corner. Oil, you can go on the top shelf. I feel like oil is going to be expensive, so top shelf, top price. Um, four dollars fifty. Let's just charge four sixty. Four sixty-five. I feel like that's a good number. Thank you. Ninety-six dollars change. Fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. One, two, three, four, five, six. I could have used five dollar note. I just realized. And twenty cents. Thank you. One dollar. 25, 35, thank you. So it's 9 p.m. I guess that's closing time. So we turn the lights off, flip the sign, and finish the day. So daily statistics, customers 23, who are satisfied good, score point plus 129, income $166.87, supply costs $111.68, Upgrade cost zero, rent zero, bill zero, total profit $55. You'll receive daily bills starting today. The first day was free and fortunately no more. Make sure to pay the bills using your computer before their due date or they'll be paid automatically. I mean, is that a bad thing? Too many have the money there? The more electrical devices, the more expensive the bills. Okay. Um, I don't think the clock starts until you open the, sh uh, the shop. So I suppose now would be a good time to order um, products like stock and sort of stock the shelves because as soon as you open the store, that's when the clock starts. We have $105. So let's buy some more. Oh, what are we running low on? Oh, we have no cereal left. Okay, so we'll buy some more cereal. Um, cereal. And then it's really expensive cereal, isn't it? Um, maybe get some more powdered sugar and some more pasta and maybe some flour if we can afford it. Flour, powdered sugar, pasta. $63. Of course we can afford it. Bridges. Furnitures. Ooh, fridge. 100 Ooh. Only $125 for the fridge. Which we couldn't afford anyway, but we definitely can't now. But maybe that will allow us to start buying... Um, milk and stuff or maybe not actually because until we get the upgrade product license if we can start stocking milk until we get that anyway it's probably locked behind this rather than the refrigeration her capabilities of our store it's got cheese there I wonder if that needs to be kept in the fridge Ooh, coffee mm, coffee now eggs because this is, I don't know if this is an American developer or not, but eggs in the UK do not need to be kept in the fridge, but I know in America they do. So it depends which way they've gone with that. And then we've got milk. Okay, let's uh, get these stuffs in. Pasta, stock what we can. Oh, I didn't mean to put it down there, but what the hell. What's done is done. And then it's going to sit in the corner till needed. I know the box isn't square, but it doesn't bother me. It might bother some people. If it does, I apologize. If closing the box makes any difference to its freshness levels. And cereal. Da da! Full shelf of cereal. Okay, ATM, I think we're good to go. Let's get the customers in. Nope, don't want the light on. More electrics means more money spent. I think we're doing okay. Um, yeah. But sometimes, if I remember correctly, the prices change. So the price you buy things from, like the average cost was 79p for the flour. Don't know if that's still the case. So worth keeping an eye on things like this, because if you bought them for a higher price, and then you still sell them for the regular price that you had originally, then you could be losing money, and you don't want to do that. $45 change. 5 and 15 cents. There we go. Thank you for your custom. Please come again. Boop, boop. Two bread, two oils. 70 cents. Okay. 50, 60, 70. Thank you. So it's back up to $59 now. 
purchase product license using computers. We completed the last objective silently because I did not see it happen. <laughs> um, okay, so we need like $200, I think, for the first product license, don't we? Uh, yeah, $200 and restore level. So we're a little ways off that yet, but saying that we're restore level two. So all we need really is the money because we're nearly at store level three. Oh, he's buying quite a few things. Powdered sugar and bread. What a lovely meal. Thank you. Yellow on the walls doesn't look terrible, does it? The floor looks okay. You don't see sort of laminate flooring like this in supermarkets very often. Yellow walls, possibly. But what colour would you guys go for? The uh, the walls and the floor. What type of flooring would you have? Or if you play the game? What uh, customization have you done already? Let me know in the comments. No change, thank you. It's not keep the change, just paid in the exact money, which is just as good. I feel it's just as good. Yeah, that's all our bread stock. Gone. We got left flour. We could stock some more flour. Might be the last of the box. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, the shelf didn't look full. I thought it was another row. Never mind. And powdered sugar. We could put more, some more powdered sugar on the shelf. Two loaves of bread. One dollar change. Thank you. $107. We're, we're store level three now. Good. So now all we need is $200 to get a better product license. But we got to be careful. Growth. Ah, so store upgrades. Okay. Okay, there's, there's quite a few upgrades you can uh, you can buy. $146,000. Wow. That's a lot of money. At the same now, when a store is in the position to buy something like that, we're probably going to be making lots and lots of lovely money. Until then, we're, um, yeah, struggling to get to 200. <laughs> Come on, buy lots of stuff. I wonder if you can buy upgrades like you can in sort of like Pumping Simulator 2, where you can sort of upgrade to the point where customers maybe will pick up more products before they come to you, or they visit some more shelves before they reach you. Is that a thing? Uh, not from this menu, but it seems bit. We don't have like a little tablet thing. $13.90. Thank you. Um, upgrades, customization, storage, hiring, growth, bills. No, I guess not. Bank. Search. Use anything down here? Nope. Time's right, though. Well, and the date is. The time's wrong, but the date is correct. It's today. How did it know? <laughs> How did it know? Okay, so... Um, we got left powdered sugar. Ooh, we can empty this box now. Two seconds. And flour. Oh, stop that in a minute. $9.70. Thank you. Just oil for you, sir. No problem. Five. Twenty, thirty, five. Oh, another customer. Yay. Maybe like the bigger the store gets, the more customers we get. Or like the higher the store level, the more customers we get. Maybe the more they'll buy while they're here. Play is full. Power, uh, power. Flower, not as popular option as I thought. 4.45 p.m. Um, I want to lift this display up just in case and lose all the products off it, which wouldn't be ideal. Good afternoon, sir. Cha-ching. We're nearly there. Only just over $6 short. But if we spend all our money on a new license, we won't have any money left to buy new products. So we'll have to make sure we get to at least 250 before we do it. Just to make sure we have enough money to buy some uh, more products to sell. Even though there's still a decent amount on the shelves, we could probably get away with it actually. Let's serve this guy and buy it. On card, no problem at all. $3.80. Okay, quick, let's do it. Management, buy. Yay, new products are available. Bottled water, cheese, coffee, dark roast, and the rest is history. Getting dark now, isn't it? Um, four dollars change. Two seconds, we just turn the light on. 
$80. Oops, 80 almost done it again. Right, market. So we're not going to buy milk yet because I feel like it needs to be kept in the fridge. So yeah, eggs need to be kept in the fridge. Cheese needs to be kept in the fridge. Coffee on the shelf, however. Oh, I can't afford that. And tea, wow, it's expensive. And milk in the fridge. Okay, so we can't buy... Apart from the coffee and the tea, everything else is refrigerated required and we don't currently have enough money for a fridge. So I guess we're not getting that right now. Boop, boop, boop. And no change for you. Thank you. Purchase a fridge or shell. New objective. Right. I feel like fridge would be a good choice. Thank you. $16. 16 dollars 16 50, 60, 75, 85. Ooh, it's getting dark. It's like 10 minutes of closing time, but we got two last customers to see out the day. Come on, empty the shelves, folks. Money, 37, 55. I'm a, I'm a quick scanner. How amazing am I scanning? It's like, choo -choo 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 -choo. no change. Thank you for exact uh, money. If I stay open, even though time f has frozen at nine o'clock, I wonder if I'll get like no new customers. Or whether like still one or two might come by, but then there's no guarantee that they will. Um, So $93 products, coffee. Can't buy both. Let's just buy coffee for now. Those ah. Even our suppliers closed after 9 p.m. Fine. Wait till tomorrow. Uh, light off. New day. So 24 satisfied customers. 128 store points. $256 income. $67 supply cost. $200 upgrade cost. We lost a little bit of money. We still ended the day on a positive balance. So that's always good. So market prices change for the foreign products. So eggs are cheaper. Tea is more expensive. And I missed the last two then. So... That means that by waiting to buy tea... Oh no, the price has gone up to tea. Milk's gone down. Eggs have gone down. Having these little indicators is handy. So the price of oil has gone down, which means now when we're selling oil... The market price is 423 So if we go for 450 lower the price a bit, because people might stop buying them if it's too high. Um, that seems to be it. So price of tea has gone up. So we won't buy any tea. Coffee stayed the same. Oh, how a coffee? We didn't order coffee, did we? Because the supplier was closed. So now we need to save $125 for... Wait, that was quick. For uh, <laughs> um, a fridge. So we can buy milk and cheese and all the good stuff. All the good dairy stuff. Open the shop. Du -du -du -du. And ready for our serving day. So we need to make $125, I think it was, for the fridge, don't we? Furnitures. Um, fridge single. So it's $200 for a tall single fridge. Or mini fridge is $125. Freezer, $300. Display fridge double. Ooh, $200. $150 for the display fridge single. Ah, now which one do we go for? Thank you. I like card payments. Not a mind count them changes. Card payments are so much easier. The world we're currently in though, isn't it? It's like cash is uh, no longer king. Because card payments are so much easier. No one everybody agrees with that. And everybody's entitled to the opinion, so it's just fine. You're selling a product without its set. <gasps> no, 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 no. Nope, nope, no, no. Coffee is not free. Coffee is definitely not free. Um, 10.50. Have I just been giving away coffee? Oh, I've been selling it for cost price. No. You were lucky. No one you're buying so much coffee. Oh, wow, I just got con, didn't I? My own fault. Completely didn't right. So don't forget, hang on, couldn't find. So there's a particular brand of flour she wanted and couldn't find. I can't believe I didn't set the price for coffee. I've just been selling them at cost price. Damn. Now these ones should be normal price yet. So it should be $10.50. Oh, 
Those first two customers don't know how lucky they were. Okay, so we need some more pastas. We're running out. Ooh, we've completely run out of flour. We have some flour here. We are going to run out shortly. So we need some more oil, flour, um, take products, um, oil, flour. What else was it? Cereal. Can we afford cereal too? Uh, where is the cereal? I'm being blind. Cereal. Ah, the oh, there it is. Number one. Okay, so it's $59. Um, pasta. Thank you. 630. Pasta. Powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. I wonder if there's a way to automate this uh, ordering process. I know we're running out of stuff. I'm sorry. Couldn't find left seeds oil. Like seeds oil? Yeah, it's oil. Wait, did we buy any? Wait, did we buy any on our order? I can't remember. Um, right, powdered sugar. All right, folks, we'll be with you in just a second. Cereal. That's such a cool box design. It looks really appetizing, too. The designers did their job with the cereal boxes. Makes you want to eat it. Uh, oil. Oh, I did buy oil. Okay, that's good. Sorry, won't be a second. I wonder if they get angry if you don't serve them in, like, in a timely manner. 28.60. Thank you. Just to pass the few. 85 cents. 50, 60, 70, 85. Hard payment. My favorite. Thank you. Yo. We run out of flour. Is that what was there? Flour? No, oh, pasta. We know about a pasta. We didn't, did we? This is supply is really quick, like literally instantly. 10, 20, 30, 1, 50. How do I remove? I oh, right click there, okay. 75, 90. Bit of a brain fart moment there. Thank you. 30 cents. Okay, let's get our pasta. Lovely pasta. Get your fresh pasta here. Technically not true, is it? Uh, five, six, seven, eight. And can you? Okay, so we need to order some more bread. Bread. Ooh, we have enough to order. Um, ah, no, what do we go for? We have 150. We can go for a single display fridge. Yeah, let's do it. We should have saved up for the bigger one, but no, with haste. Probably insta delivery, uh, insta delivered, didn't it? Yep. I think this might be the fridge. Um, open. Where are we gonna put the fridge? Um, let's put it here. Right there. It's getting dark. Twelve. Eighteen. Let me turn the light on. Two seconds. Oh, hang on, we still have products out here, haven't we? Bread. Bada. It's Welsh for bread. Okay. Just bread for you, no problem at all. Four dollars, please. The cereal for you, okay. Uh, Four dollars change. Thank you for your custom. Please come again and spend lots and lots of money. Thank you. Uh, couldn't find tea. Yeah, tea's a bit expensive at the moment. But not that kind of shop. I can afford tea right now. Okay, uh, but we can afford tea now. Let's buy some tea. Uh, tea. Or shall we wait? Let's wait. Because tea might be cheap. Uh, yeah, tea might be cheaper tomorrow, so we'll wait. Uh, we'll wait. We can buy. We can buy cheese, eggs, milk, and bottle of water. That was terrible. That was terrible. I don't want really to talk about that. Neither do British people, for the most part. I don't think, anyway. Bottle of water. 
Yes, eggs are on the way. Ooh, thank you. You bought a lot. So, 50, 70, 1, 2, 3. It's a lot of change you need. E. There we go. Ooh, people are buying more stuff now. That's good. Look at the money rolling in. Let's grab our water. Really, it's a small display, isn't it? Um, our milk it's on the bottom shelf. Might be more room on the bottom shelf. Nope. It's only half a box fixing the small fridge. Good to know for next time. Cheese. Oh, whole box of cheese. That's good. Oh, there was nothing else in there. Um, but we have no room for the eggs. Okay. Not good. 15 cents. Thanking you. Flour, $42. And 40 cents. Okay, couldn't find tea. Yeah, we'll, we'll have more tea in tomorrow. Ah, oh, it's 9 p.m. Too late to worry anything else. No oh, management. No, no management. Oh, we wanted. Uh, market. Furniture. Yeah, maybe saving up for this would have been a better idea. Oh, it was only $200. Can we sell? I probably can't. <laughs> Just sell the fridge. Um, end day. 116 satisfied customers. 11 who couldn't find what they wanted. 148 store points. And we ended the day on $4 more than we did yesterday. Any bills in yet? Uh, bills. Ooh, we have $3 and $2.60. And rent. So rent is $20 a day. Okay. Let's get this shop open. Let's get some products in. Oh, we probably should have ordered bread in a while first. Be too hasty. Bread. Uh, what else do we need? Bread. Cereal, if we can afford it. Powdered sugar. Bread, cereal, powdered sugar. Bread, cereal, powdered sugar. Oh, we can't afford all that. Oh, no, we should be able to in a sec. Let's make a sale. Ooh, our first cheese is gone. I didn't set a price, did I, on the cheese? I didn't set a price on the water either. Uh, $2.60, $2.70 for a bottle of water. That seems quite expensive. $3.50 for the cheese. Cheese is expensive, so that seems about right. Um, can I set the price on there? Can I... Can I set the price on the, on the cheese? Is there a crouch button? Um, C? Nope. Can't reach. I can't reach the milk. How do you, duck? <laughs> I don't want to give the milk away. Cost price? Oh, 74 pence. Oh, stop buying the cheap milk. Oh, I did it again. Seven four. Um, like that one's working, that one's working. How do I duck? Um, um, I'm gonna check on that. <laughs> Be right back, folks. Okay, so it turns out that there is no crouch button. So I have no idea how I'm gonna set the price on this shelf. Does anybody know? Because <laughs> that seems quite bad. Also, I've just realized that uh, for the entire first part of this video, there has been no game audio. So I'm going to play some cool music. <laughs> well, anyway. But yeah, I apologize for that. I have no idea how that's happened. At least my uh, my voice has still been audible. Right? Uh, people are buying up all the milk because they can't set the price. I'm selling it. But cost. Ah! You haven't got... Oh, uh, crap. At least I can set the price for the cheese. Uh, one, two, three, fifty. And find eggs. Cheese, seven dollars. So, if anybody knows how to um, crouch, please, please, please let me know in the comments because anything I put on that lower shelf in the fridge, and it seems like a waste not to use it, is going to get sold at cost price, and we really don't want that. 
because cost price is stupidly low. If we can't make money, the shop's going to close. And we don't want that, do we? Um, bottle of water. I'm so many bottles of water, actually. Hi. There's bread. Okay. There we go. $81 change. Wow. And 75 cents. Okay. Now, what if I sold the fridge? That seems like a bit of an oversight, though, to not be able to set the um, price of the lower shelves, because that one works. And that one works. It's just like there's a like a missing hitbox or something for the, the lower shelf of the fridge. I wonder if it's possible to sell the fridge. Um, box up. Sell. They just sell everybody everything with it, too. I feel like I did. Thirteen ninety. Did I get any money back for the fridge? I think I did. So let's save up two hundred dollars, and we're gonna buy the other fridge to see if that's any better. Because the display fridge seems a little bit bugged at the moment. Nearly there. Thank you. Um, bread, water, milk, more bread, more bread. My box is now empty. Oh, hang on, where are we going? Two hundred dollars. Okay, market furniture, single fridge. Two hundred. Ah, oh, with shipping, like a couple of cents short. Come on. Um. Ah, oh, we did have cheese. I'm sorry. Damn, he didn't buy a single thing. We will have cheese again soon. Gonna find a bottle of water. Uh, maybe we're a bit hasty deleting the, um, or selling the fridge. Does nobody want to buy regular goods? I mean, no, cheese isn't regular good, but... Yay! Now we should have enough to buy a fridge. In two dollars shipping for such a big item. That's not bad, right? So do we have the ability to like rotate items and stuff. Yet no ability to accept like, the lower price. And now we can put our eggs in the fridge. Um let's put them on this shelf though. Oh nice a full box fit in that one too. I think that was a better uh, choice than the display fridge. Water, two seconds. We just get all this stuff on the shelf. Maybe I should put the water on the bottom shelf as a bit of a tester because it's one of the cheaper things. Okay, milk. And we hopefully... <gasps> no! No, 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 no. Nope, 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 nope. 365. Okay. $2.70. So because I sat that one before, I remembered it. Ah, good. Okay, so it's $2.40. Nice. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Bread. So don't buy the fridge, the display fridge, at least the mini one in this version of the game because it seems a bit bugged. Unless it's just me. You just said all those are cost price, didn't you? Five dollars change. I know, I know. Well, let's, okay, let's order some oil. Oh, we can't. It's nine o'clock. We gotta do it in the morning. That's fine. Is there no fridge door? Oh, there is a fridge door. They just have special powers. No coffee dark roast. I know. More products coming soon. We're sorting ourselves out. And that's probably gonna be our last customer for the day. Oh, no, we got one more. Hi, car. Hi, car. Couldn't find tea. So a lot of products people couldn't find today. It's just, uh, we're waiting to see if any more customers show up. Yeah, it's not a bad looking map, actually, is it? 
Night effects are pretty good. Supermarket. I think that's all we're going to get today. Let's end the day. So 12 customers served. 14 couldn't find what they're looking for. They didn't show a change in with you. So, uh, so that's good. 112 store points income. So we ended the day on $21 yes than we did yesterday. So cereal has dropped in price. Tea has dropped in price. And powdered sugar has dropped in price. Let's buy that. Um, watch, we have $105 to play with oil, cereal, asta, flour. Oh, we've already gone over. <laughs> um, purchase them just for now. Then we'll, because the insert delivery is amazing. Probably could have left the cereal for a little bit, couldn't we? Because we still had some left, but it's fine. Um, probably open the shop. Uh, oil. Open the shop and get some more customers in. Oh, we're stocking up tea. T T T T. Top shelf item T. Okay, so it's quite over. Check that bit there, sir. Set the price for anybody who walks in. Um, Five dollars sixty for tea. Doesn't seem unreasonable. Okay, so this one is working better. So I will post a copy of the game version up for anybody to still see if that comment is relevant about the mini display fridge not working properly. And if your game version or the game version at the time you pick up the game is higher than the one I'm about to post on the screen, then you say probably. 1485. Couldn't find cheese. Coming soon when we can afford it. We afford cheese now. Cheese. We can afford cheese now. Shutting. Okay, and because we've set the price for cheese before, it should remember it. Look, 350. Yep, so it remembers the price you've set from before, which is handy. Uh, 275. Ooh, they're purchasing lots of products now. It's good. Oh, we're out of flour. We can buy more flour. Flour. Be nice when we get a storeroom up and running, because then we can just, like, stock things in bulk. Ooh, I wonder if we can hire employees to stock shelves automatically. Now, that would be handy. 12.50. Thank you. Some cereal, one dollar change, thank you. Just cheese. Three fifty. We out of. Get out of pasta, powdered sugar, coffee. Out of pasta, powdered sugar, and I don't think we have enough coffee, do we? Nope. Just order those for now. Nine ten tea for you. Thank you. Powdered sugar. And pasta. Imagine I'll get to a point where like we'll have just one of these full of each product when the store's a lot bigger. Well, that was a hefty uh, purchase. 20 cents change. Thank you. We missing now. Um, coffee. We can afford coffee now. Coffee. And management bills. May as well pay the bill. We pay a cruise interest, so it just gets paid automatically. Yeah, gross coffee. No, I keep walking around the counter because. We can definitely oops, just sort of be over here, click, and go straight to it. I need to remember that. It's much easier. It really is. Cereal. Yes. Another box in the bin. Do 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 do. Another box in the bin. Twenty-five fifty. Some decent sales now, aren't we? Thirteen fifty. 
Coffee and tea, I see you liked both in your household, sir. We're back up to $108. What are we missing? Um, we don't have any eggs left. Milk, cheese, products. Um, we order some more eggs, more milk. Water. Because these are refrigerated items, I wonder what happens if you don't store them in a fridge. Like, if you haven't got enough room on the shelf, do, do they go bad? Do you have to, like, close the box for them to stay fresher for longer? I don't know. Like, they'll store corner. Exact change, I like it. You can come anytime. Exact change, and you're always welcome. 28, thank you. Five. Three dollars forty. Okay. Are there only four refrigerated products we had access to? We'll purchase a new section using our computer to expand your store. That's the next uh, objective we have. We can buy new, um, more lights. So are these for the storeroom then? I'm tempted to buy one of these racks just to see what they are. I feel like they're pro for storing products in, so more than likely for the storeroom. But maybe we can set one up in the corner there just for keeping stuff on. Until we unlock the storeroom. Just to keep things a little tidier. Ash. Ooh, 6.50 p.m. I mean, lights wise is okay. I'm mean, guessing if we expand the store, it doesn't automatically come with lights. 31.55. Running low on pasta and coffee. Pasta and coffee. Pasta, coffee. Gonna be running low on coffee. Definitely won't be running low on pasta. Nine dollars eight. Ooh, a hefty purchase, nice. Some decent sales now. Two hundred dollars sixty-eight cents. So we buy. Ah, it's too late. So tomorrow maybe we buy the, the small rack just to see what it is. The tall rack's only an extra fifty dollars though. It'd be worth just waiting for that. Rack's truly better. Late night shoppers don't tend to buy as much, do they? This is calling in to get like odds and sods. <laughs> On the way home from work, from the night shift, or something like that. Look, we're inventing a whole life story for these people. We should probably pay our bills. Um, rent. So I'll just pay, get paid automatically. $148. Ooh, we made a decent profit today. So cereal's gone up in price. Oil has come down in price. And bottled water has gone up in price. So oil has gone down. Let's buy some oil. Just oil for now. Oops. Well, look if it stays on the screen though when you back out of it. That's quite cool. In some games, I feel like the screen would just go dark. Or a computer like switch itself off. It's quite cool that it doesn't do that. Open. Come on in all. Are we looking? Ooh, we need flour. Flour, flour, flour. Flour. 
Flower power. Instant delivery. No prime needed. We'll be a bit low on tea as well. Buy some more tea. No, we're putting ourselves further away from our goal here, but worth having these things in stock because the more we have, the more we can sell, right? Master coffee. Oh, I thought she was going to walk out with that coffee then. But now this box can go there. And the box is now empty. We're picking up a lot of stuff. Hard as well. Thank you. Oops. I'm going to shortchange myself then. He needs a trolley. <laughs> wow. Because the more we got, the more variety, the more chance they'll pick up more stuff. I'm not going to purchase a new section just yet. I want to buy a rack first. That stall is level 6 now. We're doing okay. 50 cents. Ooh, can we afford the rack? Small rack, 200. The delivery cost is going to kill me, in it? Oh, no. $2 delivery. Bargain for such a large item. Okay, so does this go in the corner? How does this work? This, this only works in the warehouse, doesn't it? Yeah. If I sell it, do I get my... Give me $250 back. Half the money. Wow. Oh, that was a waste of money, wasn't it? But I just kept it if I'd known that. It doesn't tell you it unless I'm being blind. What you're going to get for it. What does it? I just missed it. Oh. I I'm going to rag. $83 change. Wow. Could have at least bought a bit more can he? if he was paying with that much cash. Okay, so what we run out of? We run out of bread. We need some more barra. Load up the shelf. Full shelf. Oh yeah. Uh, coffee? Are we running out of coffee? Well, if we wasted so much money on that alpha we couldn't even use. Even though we're still practically new, we only had half our money back. How bad is that? I feel like that should be changed. That seems a bit mean. <laughs> no change, exact change. Thank you very much. Okay, so I'm going to buy a new section of the store then to pass on that objective. Management. Pay the bill because why not? Growth. Uh, $350. Yeah, we're nowhere near that yet. But we could be if people keep buying things like this. We probably should have checked the prices actually, shouldn't we? Because if stuff has gone up and down, we might be selling stuff at a loss. So, cereal's gone up. So, do we need to change the price? Oh, we don't have any cereal anyway. Oh, if you click on the shelf, the label disappears. Oh, that's handy to know. Like, you know, advertising is you don't have enough stock. Water. I'm gonna throw that away. Still stuff in it. Flower. What are we running low on? Uh, so powdered sugar and cereal. But cereal is expensive at the moment. We could just still we could still buy it and just sell it at a higher price. And powdered sugar. Oops. We 
Wait a minute. Let me just get the powder chugger out and stuff. Why is you all just shout at me? Having no stock. Make sure we need to set the price on cereal before we go anyway. Check that out there a sec. Um, $6.10. There we go. Oh, time for the light. Oh, we got a bit of a queue forming. 17, thank you. Cash, exact change, thank you. Cash, $1, 70, thank you. Oil, $9. That change, thank you. And four, 45. Thanking you. Tea, it was the tea. Okay. It's not okay with tea, but we can finish this box now. Still time for some more customers to show up. That's still full. Pop here. We need to buy before um, pasta and oil for the supplier shows it closes. Pasta and oil. Is he a van or anything pull up? It just like appears. They have teleporter technology. Maybe it's worth until we get a storage uh, area and just to chuck everything on shelves. Even if we already have an item of that type on a shelf somewhere. Look a bit messy though, and <gasps> we don't have any eggs left or cheese. We ran out of both of those. It's too late to order more. Ooh, $285 though. Well, we need 350 wasn't it, for the upgrade? 350 Was it worth going for that yet though? Or would it be better off just buying like a new shelf to stock things on? But then again, we're not filling the one we have at the moment, do we? And it's 9 p.m. Okay. Closed. There we go, I think that video has been long enough for now. If you want a part two, let's see if this video reaches 15 thumbs up. If it does, I'll make a part two and continue this playthrough. Thank you very much for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video and I do want to again apologize for the lack of audio for the first part of the video. That was a complete oversight on my part. Um, if you like the channel, please feel free to subscribe and until next time everybody, have a good one and see you then. Bye for now.